think you are a legal uh, you are into legal system and you are also planning to have marriages at that age can you just tell about that the swayamvaram what we call the selfly you can choose your person okay. after 50 60 in india position even in this in the new swam of western countries even in 90 years of the age yeah. they are going for the marriage right. many people there that marriage is there all the family members they are going to enjoy it yes. even grandchildren will attend that program and children will attend the program they make a celebration there but in india unfortunately after 60 anybody wants to talk about the marriage people will see very nice. constantly they are going to see it it is not a possible year after 60 70 why the marriage is required like that yes. there is a question is here yes. but marriage is only meant for the not only for the physical satisfaction also mental satisfaction also is there emotional emotional also, also is there a friend they can feel a friend for example in india every year more than 20000 people or die without the in time medical treatment is not possible for them because they are lonely living in a room when they are there heart attack is when it's going to attack they couldn't be able to shout yes so the world is not going to listen anybody in the outside people yeah. so they can't go and open the door so within that 30 minutes or 45 minutes if the ambulance will come and they will take it in time the treatment is going to available they definitely they can survive it but without this facility nobody is not there with them they are alone they are lonely is there they can't open the door and they can't sleep yeah. because there is so many other problems are there so when they are going to close the door they are sleeping it suddenly the heart attack is going to possible they couldn't able to survive suppose the somebody is there along with them if the companion is there if somebody is there automatically the survival possibility is there and not only that to share their experiences either happiness or the sorrowness to share with others also nobody is not available for them yes. for that also is required we are arranging already we made more than 700 marriages in hyderabad itself wow. and all over the world it is more than a 5000 marriages are already completed and now more than that every month third sunday in hyderabad in the av college premises there is a big swayamvaram we are arranging it for 50 plus people okay. so it is a mela it is a marriage mela like that people can attend there they can introduce themselves and whoever like each other yeah. we are going to make the marriage also there right. without any expenditure because the the sub register we request is register there only register will come there he can issue the certificate and we can give tea starts to the people the marriage can be completed not only that we are providing a agreement for them the agreement legal legal, legal. legal agreement also will be there after that marriage if any legal issues are there regarding property regarding any uh, the the convenience or the any anything share with them each other how they can share it how the future will be there in case after some time if they want to divide each other also on very friendly manner how they can able to divide it each other this all we are taking into care in the agreement we are all the clauses we are keeping it we are register the document that means it is safe of their life they they need not worry about their future if how the sharing and also family should also cannot be they need not worry it because family also will have the some safety yeah. okay the, the life partner who are coming newly their part is this much only right. they are not going to cross this one yes. that means the family also whatever they get it the clarity will be there right. then the they are going to happy because more worry about the properties yeah. and also money yeah. and influence these all the things are going to effectively so that we are going to take care So I heard that uh, you are also planning for the funerals or after death. There are some programs. Uh... Actually, in India, India, a survey is saying already 37 percent people only at present that were children are attending for the funeral functions, for the parents' funeral functions, because many people they are out of the place, yeah. out of the country, out of the state, somewhere they are living it. Yeah. So at the time of funeraling, in immediately they have to attend. The body they cannot keep after 24 years. Generally in India, 24 hours is the maximum time they will take it. Yeah. Sometimes in rare cases, two days, three days also they can take. No. Not more than that. Yeah. It is not possible here yeah. because body is not going to it's a it's not going to possible to keep. Yeah. And the traditions also not going to accept for it. Mm. That is the reason. 
within the 24 hours 48 hours people should come here but most of the places what is going on the availability of the visa and the, the leave and also money spending lakhs of rupees they have to spend it and they are they, that is the reason they are not ready to come here so suppose if anybody is here in the elder elder clubs member if anything is suddenly happen we will take the responsibility the all the funerals with the tradition system we are going to complete it according to their caste and according to their everything, yeah. everything you we, we, we will keep everything yes. and the, in the mind and we will do it so that is the reason people need not worry about it we are we are available we are, we are joining here in the old age home modern old age home or daycare center we are here tomorrow if something something is going to happen yet our, our people will come they need not worry about it. if they come or not if they come it is a very happy thing if they don't come also the same thing we are going to take responsibility here and we will finish everything that complete the responsibility that is our main motive and also a dignity elders dignity also very important after 50 60 people when they are going to old the indian community particularly the children and also young age people youth they are not respecting the elderly people they are thinking it is a already they retire retirement means they are not useful to the society yeah. that type of idea is there but in india a 70 years 80 years 90 years people also they are the president of india they are the prime ministers also they have worked like that yeah. so a person can useful he can work he act as a prime minister yeah. act as a president of india but a person is not able to use for anything yes. what they are thinking it it is very very wrong calculation a mind is different to the body body may have the age but mind there is no age heart there is no age thoughts there is no age these whatever youthful people are thinking youth thinking the same thinking will be there more than that also sometimes yes. people can think of it yes. the acuteness the knowledge and whatever is there it should be useful to the society for that we made many programs one of the program is called mediation centers that means a case can go to the court but court is very expensive like india so many other countries also the court is very expensive that much of money they cannot able to bear it which is important and our second thing is the time taking process it may take long time sometimes 10 years 20 years 30 years in india more than 3 crores cases are running in the in the court today already registered in these three course cases can be completed after 300 years it will take 300 years for that a supreme court chief justice he says this one hmm. this is his statement yeah. so the 300 years means today a case if you are going to file there is no certainty for that sometimes it may be after our death also the result may be come right. so people will lost their confidence on the legal. Uh, legal legal side so judiciary when it is going to fail entire country is going to fail and uh, totally people are going to dis- uh, disappointment will come and crime rate will be going to increase yeah. the crime is going to affect on the everybody yeah. including senior citizens also even elders also yeah. so that is the reason what we are alert to the people everywhere we are making the uh, mediation centers and uh, in the mediation center we will call all the cases even police station whatever case will there the case also will appear here and courts also they can direct they can make the direction to the go to the mediation center and there the elderly people the senior citizen people and the elders club members a minimum 10 members are going to appear there they will listen everything and the proper training we are going to make it and also proper guidelines we are going to give and manuals also we are going to provide with that they can able to resolve the problems the compromission will possible yes. once the compromission is going to take place then it is going to put on the paper the paper can be registered in the court so this is the final judgment mm-hmm. the even supreme court chief justice also he has to accept that judgment he cannot go behind that that possibility is there even suppose if you go to the lower court again they can go to the higher court then they go to the high court then go to the supreme court it may take another 20 years to 30 years time but when the compromission is possible it is a final judgment they cannot go to any other court if they go to the court also within the minute the court is going to it said the court stop this one the possibility is there so that is the reason the mediation centers and also vigilance cells we are opening the vigilance cell is like a, a any adulteration is there any short weight is there or any misleading to the people 
uh, any defective goods and deficiency of services are providing in the society, we can have the checking power. So you are uh, uh, chairman for Consumer Affairs Committee, Government of India. The Consumer Affairs Committee, as a we made the change in the Consumer Protection Act, even a, a civilian who are having the, he will have every right, like a 27 inspector's powers, like food inspector, sanitary inspector, health inspector, drug inspector, weights and medicine inspector, like 27 inspector's powers has given. That means you also act as an inspector. You need not wait for the inspector. You go, whatever the provisions you are going, whatever services, whatever goods you are getting it, whether it is rightful or not, you, what the constitution is saying, what law is saying, whether they are following or not, you go and check it. If you find out any defect, it, defective goods or deficiency of services, immediately you can file the case. So this is going to bring a revolution in the society also. When uh, unfair trade practices and uh, the, the system is going, going to take away, the, everybody will get the value for the money. Whatever you are paying, you will get the service as goods on the equal. Then you are going to be happy. Then money power also is going to, the paying capacity also is going to increase. And for that also, the elderly people, we are trained up them. We are making them in the interest. In the education committees also, we are making. In the education institutions also, the each one and teach one. That what we are requesting to the elderly people. Don't sit in the, ideally in the houses. If you sit more in the house, if you are going to attract only TV, you are not going to mingle with the people, you are not going to act you, then automatically dementia, algebras, it is going to attract. So, by 2030, for every 100 people, more than 27% of the people, they are going to attract this dementia. This possibility is there. To avoid that, every person must be active. They have to come out. Physical fitness is required. Mental fitness is required. Wellness is required. They have to go for the wellness. So then only they are going to be active. The activeness is required. We are also advising to people. We are making many programs about this. So we can change the society. And the second life better than the first life. That is our slogan. We can make it together. If the people are going to ready, we are making for them. So by 2050, world population is reaching 62% above 50 years people. And below 50 years age only 38% people are going to live in this world. That means the future is for elders, not for youth. So the elders, in future, when they are going to make the 62% when they are reaching, if they are not going to be active, if they are depending on somebody, if they are liable, the total system is going to collapse. That means they must be active, they should have the earning capacity. For that also we are providing many self-employment schemes, employment schemes. They can also earn money, yes. they can learn things and they can change the society not only youth, elderly persons also. Then only the power of the elders can be increased and also yes. they can, respect also is going to increase, dignity also is going to increase. For that many more programs we are making it and also we find out above 50 years people, 96% people are voting and below 50 years people only 33% people are voting. That means above 50% people, if they come together, if they are going on the same path, so automatically they can change even the political power also. Yeah. Whatever the party they want to do, they are going to give the more power to the elders yes. and more freedom for the elders. Then the respect, more respect to the elders. They need not beg anybody yes. because they built it everything. Yeah. So they must get that power. Whoever ready to give the power to the elderly people, for them only they are ready to vote it. So on the day, entire society is going to change. All the countries are going to learn how to respect to the elders. That is our ultimate motive. So thank you, Krishna Nadigaru. So he is doing a great job. I'm very, very happy to associate with uh, elderly club. And uh, he is very inspiring. So whatever he taught, whatever he, the vision which he shared, so I'm excited to become old, to enjoy that life. And uh, we are happy to associate them in the area of wellness, in active life. Uh, wellness means we provide them yoga, meditation, massage therapies, 
and lot of other therapies and making them happy happiness is our slogan so we want to give them happiness we want to give them every kind of entertainment like uh, you know dance or activity like playing sports and all that so i'm very happy i wanted to congratulate vishnu uh, digaru thank you for and uh, i'm very excited to see when it starts thank you